Oh hi everyone and welcome back to Not Another Bonsai Channel. You've actually just caught me in the middle of just checking on these trees that were kind of sent over to me from Brad. Uh, and he sent me a variety of different trees, different Yamadori trees. And you can see what I've done here, I've just potted them up into individual little pots, just with regular garden compost, just to get them going. You know, they're not really bonsai at this stage, but maybe, you know, in the next few months, in the springtime, maybe we can do some top pruning. We'll try to, you know, get some start, you know, styling ideas and uh, pruning decisions made on these trees and hopefully turn them into bonsai trees. But that isn't what I wanted to show you in this video. So boy, is it a cold morning this morning. You can see I have my scarf on, I have my jacket zipped right up to the top. Uh, but in this video, I wanted to do something a little bit different. So I've just reached down here. You may have seen several people, if you watch a lot of bonsai related videos, or maybe you practice bonsai yourself, that many, many people use these red handled root hooks made by the millions by the Chinese. Um, but you know, if you're looking for something a little bit different, a little bit special, there's, you're, you're in luck because there's somebody new on the scene. And if you just reach down here, this down here, is a little root hook that was made for me by Matt over at Bobcat Bonsai. Well, speaking of tools, he's actually sent me a brand new tool. So, hey, Matt, how's it going? And uh, yeah, what's this new idea that you have in mind for this new tool? Hey, Gav. So I'm out here in my workshop and I came up with a little idea that I wanted to share with you because I know you were talking about wanting to get a rake to add to your bonsai collection so my thought was i've come up with an idea let me just show you real quick yes that's right guys so i've been working in collaboration with matt and not only is he thinking of making root hooks he's also thinking of making a root rake so let's see your drawings matt and see what kind of idea you have in mind all right so here's the idea buddy this is going to be made out of a horseshoe so I've got this little horseshoe blank that I keep on hand from when I make root hooks and things like that out of them. But check this out. So we're gonna come in. Right here is about the marking of where that indent is. We don't wanna mess with that. That's gonna create a weak point. So we came in about a half inch up here and that's where we're gonna create this twist. We're gonna twist the metal, which is gonna be way too thick right there. So then I'm gonna draw that out to a point. Then we're gonna come in and notch it to kind of make like rake tongs in there. And then once we're done, we'll go ahead and bend it over to create the rake front. I oh, see so you're thinking of turning a, a horseshoe into a root rake. That sounds really cool. Yes, you better get the old furnace lit and yeah, look forward to seeing what you can make. Now I'm gonna pull it out and work on flattening out where the tines of the rake are gonna be. We're working on getting it all spread that way we have a good area to cut in the rake tines and just make sure we can grab as much material as possible. So then this part right here, what we're gonna be doing is putting a little curl, basically I call it a mermaid's tail. Actually, I believe everybody calls it a mermaid's tail or a fish tail. But we're putting a little curl on it. That way we can begin to shape where the rake tines are gonna come down to. Uh, next step is going to just be to get them cut in and then we'll be getting real close to finished. So now we cut in the tines real quick and this is just a rough cut so we'll end up having to go back and shape and clean it all up but here we go. Awesome, Matt. That all looks super cool. Uh, couldn't wait to receive the root rake, and uh, was yeah. After seeing those videos, I was really excited to see what you had made. Well, as it was, a little parcel did arrive the other day, and it is just down here. So let's take a look and see what this root rake looks like. So let's take a look inside this little packet. So I have just taken a quick peek just inside, just to make sure that there's nothing in this packet that is unsuitable for you know to go on film. But we can see just in there that is the root rake let's uh, tip it out and i think oh there you go there's a little sticker in there too so this of course is 
Bobcat Bonsai. That's Matt's logo. That's his channel. I will put a link to his his channel in the description below. But yeah, fantastic. I'll have to find a place to stick that. But that, yeah, thanks for that, Matt. That's excellent. I'll put that somewhere. And this, of course, is what we've been waiting for. This is the root rake. So you can see it has been made out of a horseshoe. And that is the end there. Fantastic. Nice little teeth. Really, really well made. Excellent. Yeah, excellent. Yeah, thanks so much for this, Matt. That's that's excellent. Oh, we can also see just on the end there. I'm not sure if you can see that on camera. You can see he's put BB001. So this is the first one that he's made. It's a prototype. You know, as you saw earlier in the in the drawings that he did, it was an idea that he had in mind. He, uh, you know, working in collaboration with him, he said, would I like to try it out and demo it and, you know, give it a go? And I think, well, I'm, I'm over the moon with it. I think this is fantastic. It's it's going to come in handy for some upcoming repotting projects. And no doubt you'll see this in upcoming videos. But yeah, this is fantastic. So yeah, thanks so much for this, Matt. I, I really am over the moon. That is That is awesome. That really is. It's, it's always nice to have something that's been handmade and, and made by a friend of yours. And I must just stress that this video, I, I'm not being paid by Matt. You know, this isn't a sponsorship video. Uh, Matt is just a really good friend of mine who happens to make bonsai tools. And he asked me if I could share one of these tools on my channel. And of course, he, he uh, has been offering them to different people within the bonsai community. Um, he's been doing the same with these root hooks too. And he's just a really fantastic chap. So if you're interested in seeing some more of his content, he's over at Bobcat Bonsai. I will put a link to his channel in the description box below. And if you're interested in, you know, getting one of these tools, whether that be the root hook, root rake, I think he also does grafting knives and uh, other types of tools too. So if you're interested in having a custom made tool, you know, get in touch with him and I'm sure I'll be able to work something out for you. So yeah, that's it for today, guys. So yeah, thanks for joining me on this one. Kind of a, a you know, different video to the norm. But I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, take it easy. And until next time, have a great day. And I'll catch you on the next one. And that'll go on there just like so. Looking good.